2023 predictions. How can me, we become better, more happier, healthier, well integrated with myself and God and society and the universe? Hmm. I can tell you. What can I expect uh, in 2023 for my spiritual side and my personal growth? I think that this is a great question. It's more a matter of what do you want to create for yourself and how you're going to do it. You know, that's the one thing we're talking about predictions. But that's the one thing that we have within our own power is how we're going to relate to the world around us and the actions we're going to take. So personally, I'll tell you what I'm going to do is I want to spend more time meditating, more time working out, more time reading. Uh, I'm trying to diversify as much as I can in my investments in education so that I can get more of my time back. And ultimately, my goal is to spend more time in nature, uh, to spend more time in nature, to spend time doing survivalism, and, and, and ideally buy some land where I can start planting food and right. and, ha and start a family. That's myself. What about you? Nice. What about you? I'm working with a farm, helping the farmer um, reach people directly, which is great. Helping Canadian farming, Ontario farming, support local and ensure that we as a society, as a local society, say Ontario, that's local, that's, that's big, but it's local, um, can have our own economy and be depending on each other for everything that we need. Mm. Sounds like the way forward to me. So 2023, um, support and grow your communities and your communal roots. Mm and your ability to um, maybe share or volunteer or buy a piece of land and um, try to uh, work off the land yeah. or support others that can do that directly. That sounds good to me. Yeah. What about you folks out there? What are you, what are you, what's your plans for 2023 and how do you aim to navigate the, you know, the coming year from your own personal perspective? Tell us down in the comments.